Hi guys, it's Ashley Bidette coming at you guys with one more video. My son is being an angel and he's giving me so much life because he's doing good with his nap. So I figured um, he's going to be asleep for at least two hours. Let's get two hours worth of filming done. And I will edit and upload later when he allows me to. But really quickly, I'm just going to show you a bunch of stuff that I um, purchased over the month of May. We are now in June. And so what I'm going to do from here forward is I'm going to do once a month a haul video for you guys. And if I, do, if I haul or shop more than um, normal I will do these videos more frequent or if you like these videos I will do them more frequent but for now I'll just once a month show you like a bunch of um, stuff that I picked up over the month that is worth talking about so um, without further ado let's get started so the first place that I went to is Ulta um, my natural hair I'm trying to get into the habit of having it out more taking care of it and learning how to do it because I don't know how to do my real hair. I don't know how to make it look good and presentable, but it's a pretty nice length. So um, I decided to invest in my hair. So the first place I went to was Ulta. I picked up the Joy Co K Pack Intense Hydrator. I have the shampoo to this and I have another K Pack conditioner, but I didn't have the Intense Hydrator, so I wanted to try this, which I love. Um, I've tried it once and I loved it. So I got that. I got the um, the Redken Anti Snap, um, and again, this haul is compliments of um, Glam Twins three three four. I love their hair and I love their videos, and these are products that they said were um, really good and they recommended. So I decided to try them, and they were right. They are really good. They were worth the money. So Joy Pack Intense Hydrator, the Redken Anti Snap, which they swear by. Um, the Kimura Blow Dry Spray, as well as the Carry Care um, Anti Dandruff Moisturizing Conditioner. Um, they're having a sale on this stuff. I think that they're taking this out of the store, so everything is on clearance. I'm gonna go back this weekend and see if I can pick up some more um, products by Carry Care because I really like this, and so I'm gonna see if I can find a shampoo and some other stuff um, because it was on sale. This was like six bucks, um, and then from. Walmart I picked up this it's like a flat iron spray and I actually like this I don't know if I love it but I did like it so I just wanted to show you guys that as well in conjunction with the hair products that I bought my blow dryer went out I tried the babyless um they had the cute red babyless um flat flat iron and blow dryer in Marshalls and TJ Maxx so I picked those up I did not like them when I did my hair they did not perform well so I picked up just another one of the blow dryer that I already had because my blow dryer went out and this one I love with the attachment comb to it. It gets my hair so straight just on a blow dry. So I got that from Sally's. Um, it was about 40 bucks I want to say. Um, I think I bought some. Yeah. Also from Sally's I picked up a pair of scissors which I have not used yet. But my hair is overdue for a trim so I picked those up. Also from Marshalls when I went and got that hair stuff I also picked up this really cute it's a bouffant or a shower cap. It is waterproof on the inside and it looks like a material or a cloth material on the outside, but it works really well. And I thought it was really cute and stylish, so picked that up. Also at Marshalls, or actually TJ Maxx, this was $5. But it's just a cute little mirror. I didn't have a mirror that I could do my makeup with um, handheld, and I want to start giving you guys some tutorials. So I thought that this would be perfect if I am filming from here. I could sit here and I could do my makeup with it. Um, so it's perfect and it has two small mirrors on the back and these magnify much more than this. Um, also I picked up from Target a selfie stick. This was under 20 bucks. Um, this is the brand. It is the Promark brand. It was like 15 bucks. It may have been 16 bucks but long story short it was under 20 bucks. I love this thing. Um, it twisted off. But um, this is it. It goes on here and your iPhone goes on here and then you can um, take your selfies. So love that. That was a great pickup. Uh, from Bath and Body Works, I picked up some hand sanitizer. These were 5 for $5. Or no, 5 for $10. Up. No, no, no. Yeah, 5 for $5. And then I picked up the Gecko. If you watched my What's My Diaper Bag video, then you've seen the little Gecko um, holder that I picked up. But... Um, there's one in there that I gave one to my hubby because it's like a, a cologne scent. And then here are three more of them. And then there's one in the actual 
Boulder. I went to Nigel's in the Valley. I picked up some banana powder, which I'm wearing now and learning how to use, but I love this stuff. Um, from this store, I also picked up some Vicks Vapor, Vapor Rub. And the reason I picked this up is because I did get stretch marks when I was pregnant with my son. And so someone told me that if you use saran wrap, you put this on your stomach and then you saran wrap it and then you wrap your stomach that it would do wonders. I've only used it one time so I'm not sure if it really works but um, I got this thing from Ross. It was $5.99 and it's just basically an athletic waistband. And then while I'm waiting for my waist trainer to come, this is something that I saran wrap my stomach and then I tie this around my stomach and um, really tight. What I love about this one really quick is that it is the Velcro here. And this one is better to me than like all the mommy bands that I've seen because they came with a specific place where you to put it. Whereas this one, you can put it anywhere. So I can get it as tight as this and it fits around the whole band. So as your waist goes in, you can still adjust it without having to get a smaller size. So this is a great buy and I'm going to do a review on these for the mommies out there looking for a cheaper alternative to the um, mommy bands that are out there on the market. Um, a few makeup buys, makeup wedges, since I have bought that banana powder, I figured some wedges would be perfect to, um, bake, I think that's what, how they say, bake, is that what they say? Um, I bought some brushes from Eco Tools, it was just the two travel, and these are perfect for like your makeup bag, because they're both double-ended, it's like an eyeliner brush, a blender brush, and two flat brushes, so it's perfect for your makeup brush or your travel makeup bag so that you can have brushes at all times um also at walmart i picked these up i think they were the goody brand don't quote me there's a three pack so the other one is in the wash but these are the microfiber towels that you see all over instagram where you can just wet it and then i can use this and just wipe off my whole makeup i can use nyc liner i can use any type of eyeliner mascara on my eyes i can use any kind of brow gel and it will all come off with just water in this towel so i'm going to do a review on these as well um i cut the tags off unfortunately so i don't remember what brand they were so i'm going to have to go back into walmart and see what the brand was so that i can review these but these are awesome and i've seen them all over instagram by another brand and these work just as good but they're much cheaper because it's like a three pack and they were like under 10 bucks um I picked up the chocolate bar palette which I vlogged a couple days ago. I'm in love with this thing. This thing smells so good and it works so good. So this is like my favorite, um, this is going to be my go-to makeup eyeshadow palette for the summer. Um, also while I was at MAC, I picked up, not MAC, I was at Sephora when I got that. I also picked up the Kat Von D Lolita. Uh, what, is this, what are these called? Everlasting Liquid Lipsticks. And Lolita is, Lolita is all over the internet as like the go-to, um, I thought my son was waking up, as the go-to or a really, really popular lipstick from them. So I've tried it and I loved it, so I'm happy that I got to get my hands on this because every time I go to um, Marshalls or Marshalls Sephora, they're always out of that and also they're always out of the lipstick. Um... I bought, picked up a bunch of lashes. I could get the name of the store, but it's like an Asian, like 99 cent store. And they had like a bunch of lashes that were like a, under a buck. So these are the only ones I have with me on hand, but I picked up like 10 pair of these and I love them. Um, yeah, and then I got the Inglot Gel Liner in 77. This is like the most popular gel liner all over like Instagram, like makeup artists. That are popular makeup artist or popular makeup artists on Instagram swear by this like Amrezy and Makeup Shayla. So I had to pick it up and see. So I picked this up from a Macy's um, in the Fox Hills Mall in LA. So if you are looking for this and you live in Los Angeles and you don't want to order online, the Fox Hills Mall Macy's does have an Inglot stand in it right across from Mac. So I'm happy I got to grip, put my, uh, get my hands on this without having to order it online. Um, I picked up some blow dryer hair clips which are in the bathroom but I also got a cuticle cutter. I want to start keeping my nails and my toes up so I picked up a cuticle cutter so that I can make that possible. Um, this is one of my favorite pickups and this is the boba wrap and I don't know if you guys can see it but it's just made to carry the baby. Like I wear this thing and it keeps him so good so I can go and I can go to Walmart, Target, 
I can go to Sephora, I can go through the whole mall and he'll stay sleep and content. I can pull him out, I can breastfeed him if he needs to eat, but he stays so good in this. Um, so this is like worth every penny and then it's so cute because I am one of those people, I love to like showstopper stuff and this like no matter where we go we get so many stares and so many people oh my god oh my god oh my god so this thing right here was definitely worth every bit of the money even though i was able to get that on a gift card from amy or from our baby shower um i had a store really quick these are that goodie ouchless um headbands or what do you call these hair ties not headbands but I got a large pack of these because being a mom like right now my hair is down but as soon as he wakes up I'm gonna pin my hair into a bun because you gotta keep your hair out of your way with your babies 